morning, Dave. Hi. I'd just like to uh, share with you a book which I've just made, which is one of three, uh, on the works of Henry Lawson. It's actually the same poem called Reedy River. And I was inspired to do this one after having made a trip to New South Wales last year. And uh, we went to Henry Lawson's museum, where, of course, it's all about his life and photographs of him and where he lived. So I thought I'd revisit this particular poem, which is um, a, called Reedy River. And if we start at the, the front of the book, you can see that I was able to find a couple of pieces of um, timber which was lying around in the garden, and um, they became uh, ideal for what my needs were. In fact, um, on one of the boards there was this uh, fungus growing and it left this uh, beautiful impression on the uh, surface. <clears throat> so I cleaned up the boards, cut out some uh, letters and then um, stuck them on to the board and then with some very heavy varnish, which is called liquid glass, I was able to achieve this watery look so it looks like a river flowing with the, the reeds floating across or growing from the side. I also managed to um, get the name of Henry Lawson in the side by scraping the varnish off and uh, leaving an impression of the letter forms. The book itself is of course by Henry Lawson's Reedy River and these on the left hand side here are cut out letters with some airbrush work. Then on the left, the right hand side, I've done some hand lettering, which is very rare today, done mainly with a brush, having drawn it out first and then, as you might say, coloured it in. But the, the bottom part is done with uh, a pen. The verses are all written in blocks and different weights to suggest the, the speed of the river and the strength of the river. The, the letter forms move around from left to right uh, rather than just being upright to show how water ripples along and bobs along. I've uh, indicated some reeds behind here to give it a more active background to make it look more interesting and then added some airbrush work after I've done the writing. The final end papers are just done the sim similar to the front surface uh, with cut out letters and airbrush work. I hope you're able to see the other two books which are up on the um, I think it's Facebook, and, um, and our website. let us know what you think. You're also on our website, www.davewood.com.au.